Hello, students. In this lesson, you will learn about Trojan Horse. What is Trojan Horse in a computer world? Trojan Horse is a program downloaded and installed on a computer that appears harmless, in fact, malicious. Unexpected changes to computer settings and unusual activity, even when the computer should be idle, are strong indications that a Trojan is residing on a computer. The delivery method typically sees an attacker use social engineering to hide malicious code within legitimate software to try and gain users' system access with their software. Or you can say, Trojan. Is it is a type of malware that typically gets hidden as an attachment in an email or a free-to-download file, then transfers onto the user's device. Once downloaded, the malicious code will execute the task the attacker designed it for, such as gain backdoor access to corporate systems, spy on users' online activity, or steal sensitive data. Indications of a Trojan being active on a device include unusual activity, such as computer settings being changed unexpectedly. How do Trojans work? Unlike computer viruses, a Trojan horse cannot manifest by itself, so it needs a user to download the server side of the application for it to work. This means the executable line .exe file should be implemented and the program installed for the Trojan to attack a device's system. A Trojan virus spreads through legitimate-looking emails and files attached to emails, which are spammed to reach the inboxes of as many people as possible. When the email is opened and the malicious attachment is downloaded, the Trojan server will install and automatically run every time the infected device is turned on. Devices can also be infected by a Trojan through social engineering tactics, which cyber criminals use to coerce users into downloading a malicious application. The malicious file could be hidden in banner advertisements, pop-up advertisements, or links on websites. A computer infected by Trojan malware can also spread it to other computers. A cyber criminal turns the device into a zombie computer, which means they have remote control of it without the user knowing. Hackers can then use the zombie computer to continue sharing malware across a network of devices, known as a botnet. For example, a user might receive an email from someone they know, which includes an attachment that also looks legitimate. However, the attachment contains malicious code that executes and installs the Trojan on their device. The user often will not know anything untoward has occurred, as their computer may continue to work normally with no signs of it having been infected. The malware will reside undetected until the user takes a certain action, such as visiting a certain website or banking app. This will activate the malicious code and the Trojan will carry out the hacker's desired action. Depending on the type of Trojan and how it was created, the malware may delete itself, return to being dormant, or remain active on the device. Trojans can also attack and infect smartphones and tablets using a strand of mobile malware. This could occur through the attacker redirecting traffic to a device connected to a Wi-Fi network, and then using it to launch cyber attacks. Most common types of Trojan malware. There are many types of Trojan horse viruses that cyber criminals use to carry out different actions and different attack methods. Like backdoor Trojan, banker Trojan, distributed denial of service Trojan, downloader Trojan, exploit Trojan, fake antivirus Trojan, game thief Trojan. Instant Messaging Trojan InfoStealer Trojan MailFinder Trojan Ransom Trojan Remote Access Trojan Rootkit Trojan Short Message Service Trojan Spy Trojan Sunburst Don't worry, we will discuss each and every Trojan in upcoming lessons. How to Recognize a Trojan Virus a Trojan horse virus can often remain on a device for months without the user knowing their computer has been infected. However, telltale signs of the presence of a Trojan include computer settings suddenly changing, a loss in computer performance, 
or unusual activity taking place. The best way to recognize a Trojan is to search a device using a Trojan scanner or malware removal software.